The United Kingdom is without a leader, if you've been following recent events. So, we're gonna get in early. It's time to decide who's gonna colonize them this time round. This will include Ireland as well. We don't like it when we refer to them as the British Isles. Even if people keep fucking doing that. I don't know how many leaders we need, I'll be honest. I- how many can I add? Holy shit, there's a lot of them. I mean, off the bat, we have the Dutch. No, they're- they're always- they always love a good colonization. Canada seeks revenge. Can Scotland become independent? Australia has taken the fight back to Europe. Uh, we have to have Gandhi. No, of course. Yeah, throw in Gilgamesh. Go on. So, there's gonna be 41 empires trying to settle on the islands. Uh, this is gonna be quite crowded, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> oh, something's gone wrong already. Hang on. Hang on, Sean. Your allies will follow your lead. Sean, no! Fight, great warrior king. Sean, please. Wait, the leaders are random now? Oh, now shit, I didn't pay attention. Quest, oh, we have no idea who we're getting now. Okay. All right. Uh, the doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, uh, take three. Take three. No. Is it the map itself? I live in the UK and that just happens here sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> the Dutch could spell on cop. I don't have any mods loaded. I think it's just the map. All right, let's just try it without anything crazy. Just see if the map even loads, right? Let's just see if it loads. And then we can see what the limit is. Okay, so it. I think it might be the number of civilizations trying to get in here. If I had to hazard a guess, because the game actually loaded at that time. We'll turn off the city-states. Okay, let's try this. Okay, that has worked. So maybe it's the sheer volume of city-states. So let's see how many of those we can get back in. Can we process 12 city-states? Okay, that's also loading. That's also loading. Okay, we're gonna bump it up to 16. So we got them in there. Okay, so now, yeah, so now it's starting to give out a bit because you can see like there's just a settler here. We're starting to run out of space already if we're that close to each other. Uh, but let's see if we can get four more in real quick. 40's not enough. We need more. <laughs> Dad, please just quest. start the movie. From the on towards the oh, 44 is too much. All right. Wait, what if I try 18? Can I squeeze in just two more? Oh shit, I didn't even set the map. Hang on. I didn't. Well, okay, I gotta wait. Let me try it again. Where the size of your arms <laughs> fail. I'm being shut the use fuck your up. Head. I'm gambling, man. Okay. To the great, the great beast, beast of the Stone Age. To the man taking, taking his first upright, upright steps. steps. You, you have come, come far. Early, early cradle, cradle of civilization. On, on toward the stars. the stars. Your wits will serve you well, Ambiorix. Where the size of your armies fail, use your head. I don't think we're gonna have much wits left, Sean. You wasted 50 minutes of my life. First time chat from Bure. I'm so sorry. Now begins your greatest quest. From this early cradle of civilization on towards. No, 16 worked before. No. It only works if you get a start that can map out a city. Oh shit, is that what it is? That means I can just roll the dice constantly. Your allies will oh, follow thank god. Lead. If I hear Sean Bean one more time, I'm gonna fucking throw up. Welcome to Vietnam. How's it going? It's nice to meet you, welcome. Oh my god, there's not much distance between our cities. Yeah, we might have overcrowded this place. Are we even gonna- are we even on the UK? I think we are Ireland. Wait, what's happening here? They're facing rebellion. What happened? I haven't even taken them over or anything. Unmet city state is already dead. It's it's turn 14. Oh no, Vietnam's recovering. Hang on. Oh no. <laughs> Am I gonna lose? Okay, if we if we declare war fast enough, uh, and like just take over here. Oh great, they have a builder. Let's just nick that real quick. We might as well go to the war here, yeah. They have a lot of food too. Oh no. The workers are gonna have to be careful getting back. There we go. Get in there, lads. You're doing great. I might just lose the game. After all this setup, it might... <laughs> it might just be over. We're gonna have to listen to Sean Bean again if we die. There we go. <laughs> it's okay. Now we don't have to worry about loyalty. We just took killed our neighbor in time. Rebellion in seven turns. Oh, but look! Full loyalty. It's coming back. Oh my god, there's an uprising. You know what might help us recover if we just quickly declare war on Portugal? I need their builder. Well, I mean, I don't know who's gonna be leading the UK, I'll be honest, but it certainly isn't gonna be us. Is there anything I can do to stop this happening? What if I quickly chopped out a tree? 
No, I don't, I don't think that... Oh, now he's dead. Okay. Oh my god, they're fucking... <laughs> I don't think we can salvage this. We made it to turn uh, 36. Uh, our, our empire has crumbled. Oh, Sean this Bean's back again as well. Civilization on towards the stars. <laughs> no! Your wit, your hands fail. <laughs> no. Use your head and build a tank. We're an hour and 15 in, and we have accomplished nothing. The stars. Your wits will serve you well, Ambiorix. Hang on. From the first stirring. Oh no! Wait, no, that's not them. Okay, it's loaded. It's loaded. The will guard the world's natural oh, beauty. That's because we start in the ocean. After. That's why it's loaded. This actually may be disastrous. There may be no space on the- Oh, good fucking lord, game. Why would you- <laughs> Where's the coast? Where's the fucking coast? You know, I didn't think it could get worse than crashing every time. Where the fuck are we? Where's the- Where's the UK? Where's the land? <laughs> even when we do land, it's all mountain tiles, so we can't even land. Are you fucking kidding me? We can't even get on the land. It's all mountain. Wait, that's the edge of the map? What? Oh no, that means the land's the other fucking direction. I'm gonna fucking scream. It's turn 18 already! Wait, no, where's the fucking land? Where is the land? Does the UK exist anymore? Where is it? That's the bottom of the world! It's not here! How are we leading in science? <laughs> I do like how they're all singing. They're having a good time. Okay, I gotta restart. I gotta restart. I think what's happened is we're, we spawned on the wrong side of the world, and I think the UK is like past the mountain range. We're gonna have to start again. We spawned on the wrong side the of the world. Of life beneath water. The Scottish Empire. The okay. Advantage of your weaker neighbors there's hope. Your fearless Highlanders. Oh my God, there's hope. Thank you, Scotland. It only took an hour and a half. They haven't settled. If I. Oh, please leave your settler unattended. Hang on. Can I just take their settler and just instantly conquer? I mean, no one needs to know. No, I can't. I can't. I've done it wrong. Oh, no. I reload. From the first stirrings of life beneath water. Hey, Sean Bean, how you doing? <laughs> oh, my God. I can't. That is huge. This cat has been defeated. Simply outplayed. And we hadn't met anyone, so no one knows. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna settle on the sheep. It's a dangerous settle, I'm gonna be honest, but I think we can pull it off. There's more sheep. Yep, this is perfect. Oh my god, this place is beautiful. Holy shit, Scotland. Uh, let's get let's <laughs> Okay, you tried Scotland to get the cows. Something's kinda going on there. It looks a bit fishy. The high hills are mine by right and custom, you're better off settling elsewhere. But like the Scottish Highlands, we're settling in here now. Declare war. I I can't declare war instantly again. We gotta at least get started. <laughs> the game's like you should settle more quickly before they notice. The best neighbors are distant ones. Right now, you are India's best neighbor. Um, that mean we're a good neighbor? I can't tell if he's being sarcastic. He's flirting. Like Ethiopia, it really doesn't like me at the moment. <laughs> no grievances. <laughs> We've done nothing wrong, and they absolutely despise us. We want to rename our towns as well. We are playing as Scotland here. There we go. There's Nova Scotia. We could just go Prince Edward Island. <laughs> I, I know it's not an island, but it's the thought that counts. It's a metaphorical island. It's because of all the mountains that surround it, right? Oh, so it's like Rhode Island. <laughs> oh, hang on, but we also have to do, like, Nintendo uh, brand uh, marketing of here, of course. Just to, like... Clearly designate that it's new. You got to stick the word new on the front of it. Hang on. You know, they actually add more to that, though, in recent years. It's not enough. It's not just enough for news. You got to add, like, the lux on it as well. Just to cover all our bases. Don't forget a random number at the end. I think we might have one character. Hang on. Mr. Mayor, please. Like, we can't fit this even on the town charter anymore. It's just too much. I got to get a few more in. Hang on. 
Let me just write on the back of the charter. You have so few troops, aren't you scared for your life? He looks very menacing when he's doing the Mr. Burns hand pose. I'm gonna be honest with you. Uh, I just realized that Ethiopia has completely boxed us in in terms of the land. It's actually, it's actually a little problematic. We don't have anywhere we can go. <laughs> just stand here. It's like we, ju we just want to watch the fireworks. There we go. Oh wait, no, we we can fight them now. Okay, we got we actually got to back up a bit. <laughs> just take the city like instantly. I mean, they could actually do it, couldn't they? They're wait, they're joining me, are they? Are they becoming Scottish? Oh shit, they are. Oh, that's fantastic. Wow, S Scotland really starting strong here. <laughs> it's a shame I'm not gonna have any free warriors because they all um killed themselves fighting my forces, which they want to be friends with. Like, they're like running at us like with their clubs here. It's like big fan. Can't wait till we work together. <laughs> How's it going, Soda? Oh Jesus! Welcome aboard. There we go. That sounds that sounds about right. Ongoing competition to appease the gods. The gods have warned us the end of the world is coming. They will grant their followers boons, but we must first provide our. It's the raspberry jam word again. Only the most zealous will be rewarded. Using the sacrifice adjacent unit action with the soothsayer unit. Gaining score equal to the combat strength the sac- Wait, what? Ember suits area units can use a sacrifice adjacent unit action on friendly units adjacent to volcanoes. What the fuck? We don't have a volcano as well. Uh, God almighty, I hope none of these are volcanoes. Oh, I didn't even think about that. What do we want to name our religion? Oh, pe oh okay, people are actually quite hyped for the crabs. I do love how it's like so many uh, uh, like icons, like actual like real religions. Like, yeah, Catholicism, like Judaism. What, well, the crab? Crabatalism? <laughs> it is a bit menacing. I do like crabatalism. The crab dreidel. The crab eedrel? The crab eedrel? <laughs> I mean, I kind of like the sound of that. <laughs> Our empire poses no threat, apparently. He doesn't know about the crabs yet. Our missionary is ready. Uh, we can just take over their pantheon now. Like, that sounds fantastic to me. You're one of the few with a religion. Yeah, it converts in 66 turns. Okay, we can we can rapidly speed this up. I'm gonna be able to buy another missionary like every six turns now too. Anuk Dido. How you, how's it going, Cartage? Have you heard of crabs? <laughs> Suddenly everyone likes us except for Ethiopia. Declare friends. Declare friends. And we'll denounce Ethiopia. <laughs> Enjoy your crabs. I almost got Machu Picchu now as well. Oh, that, that looks fantastic. The most Maybe advanced golf course of all. To In the mountains. Sky. That is fantastic. Oh, that actually looks so cool. That was just worth it for the aesthetics, honestly. It gives us more money, too. Crabs won out in Fez. That's fantastic. That's putting way more pressure on them now. No hour of life is wasted. Like, that's great, Sean Bean. Have you heard of crabs? Keep spreading the crabs. Your one job is to convert this city. That's all we need you for right now. Converts in six turns? You're converting now. Welcome aboard. How's it going? Have you heard of crabs? Oh, we got our first writer. It's Val Mickey. What's he gonna do? Upon his string, the hero laid an arrow, like a snake that hissed. It was feathered with the rushing wind. What's that got to do with crabs? I like how this went from Scotland to crabs. I like how this has gone from like, who will rule the United Kingdom to crabs. Oh, okay. I think he's had enough of a crabs. Declares a surprise war. Right, that might be bad. We want to get a new policy soon to increase the rate. Ay, we produce units. Uh oh. Going ongoing war. What if I throw in a shiny horse? <laughs> okay, that's sweet. Yeah, that's sweet. That's enough. <laughs> The perfect deal. <laughs> now I know what you're saying. You can't do it. There's no way. But what if <laughs> I'm gonna get the entire continent united against them? <laughs> Wait, where were you in this? <laughs> it's nice to meet you as well, Saladin. But like, I wasn't expecting you here. Okay, uh, the world religion. We need to set this to be ours. I'm hoping I just have enough. I have faith in the crabs. World religion passed, yes! I'll be honest, I kind of just want to take their capital for funsies, if I can. Uh, we can establish a monarchy if we want. We might as, we might as well for the moment. All hail the crab king. Crabs will rule these lands now. <laughs> Laventa has now declared war in Ethiopia. Like, goddamn, those are some good crabs you sent. We will fight. 
alongside you. The crusade sounds nice for the novelty. I'll be honest, guys, but I don't think the crusade is very good. Scripture, crab scripture, and the crab commandments sounds way more enticing here. The crab Bible. The cry- the cryble? The crabble? <laughs> it is astonishing that every soul should forget its own nature and think itself as a living soul residing in the body, as if confined in a pot. Be honest, that yoga is too deep for me. But okay. Pot? Crab in a pot? Wait a minute. <laughs> Did we ever get another campus as well? This guy, this guy has just been sitting here. No, we, we, we've kind of failed to do that. We kind of abandoned science for crabs. We got a hundred fade a turn. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, they don't have walls. Uh, well, gang. Let's just slowly get to work, I guess. Please. Please, I don't want to lose my city. Hey, gang. How you doing? Oh, you must be really regretting your decisions by now. Oh, they're coming for us. Oh, no, because they got the walls up. I'm not going to be able to take them. Okay, just uh, pillage as much as you can on your retreat. More crabs. More crabs, please. This guy is also here to spread crabs. Please. More crabs. More crabs. Thank you for the crabs. Delhi has fallen to the crabs. Uh, Leventa is next. I think if we get Leventa, then yeah, everything else kind of falls into place. I wonder what, what life is like in the UK right now. <laughs> because we never made it. I don't know, this stream is like a bloody lie at this point. It wasn't supposed to be. I wonder how they're doing though. Please. <laughs> like I have an offer that might entice you. As our army has them completely surrounded. Meanwhile, the assault on Leventa continues. Oh, never- Okay, never mind, we're done. The Babylon men! They have some new fancy cavalry, but I don't think it matters, because what we can do is simply bombard... ...and walk into the city. You tread on dangerous ground by making common cause with city-states. I- I don't think this is the time, Dido. What will Ethiopia give me now? If I'm now, like, make peace? They will cede their city. I can't ask them to give me another city. I can take their They'll give me their diamonds. I'll take all of their money. <laughs> well, there we go. Uh, we have retaken uh, Cork and Kerry. Only took 151 turns. We still haven't made it to the UK. We still haven't got over there. Uh, but the crabs are going wild. Yeah, dude, how's that working out for you? <laughs> Welcome to the Scottish Highlands. Oh, no, he's... <laughs> no. I don't think they're long for the world. This might be it. Got our first golf course. This golf course represents our civilization spirit and defines the landscape of our empire. Look at that. We gotta, we gotta, gotta fix everything else that's still on fire too. We're working on it, but the golf course is lovely. Okay, and we gotta... It might be a tall order here. But we're bringing crabs. Who will win? Mecca and the center of Islam or crabs? The weirdest Harry Hill fight situation we can possibly have. Uh, there goes Ethiopia. <laughs> Once the cradle of Buddhism, but now the faithful flock to the temples of Krabatilism. <laughs> we got them, boys. It is wild to me that the entirety of Ethiopia, like, converted to Scotland as time was going on in this game, too. A vast like, like, apart from the capital, apart from the capital, we had to fight for that one. But, like, the rest of them of are just joining our side. <laughs> Sweet, another free city. Yeah, welcome aboard. Uh, of course, gonna have to redo this one. There we go, that, that should be good. I think we've done pretty damn good. Five out of 16 civs have been converted to capitalism. Our closest contender is Judaism. I think we can beat them. Came you good? I think civs just having trouble. I can't save it either. But you know what? We came close enough. <laughs> I'd say that's enough. They know of crabs, and it's only a matter of time before they overtake them. Still not sure the new leader of the UK is, though. I honestly have no idea. 